The future of transportation is here. Minnesota is exploring how connected and automated vehicles, known as CAV, might impact how we travel. But what does that mean? What are connected and automated vehicles? Connected vehicles use technology, such as cell phone apps, to communicate with other vehicles, connect with traffic signals, signs, bicyclists, pedestrians, and much more, and to gather data to help make roads safer and to improve the flow of traffic. Automated vehicles also use technology to do driving tasks like steer, accelerate, or brake with little to no human input. Some vehicles require a human to monitor the roadway. Others require no human intervention. The human interaction depends on the technology in each vehicle, each with specific requirements. CAV vehicles can have connected technology, automated technology, or both. This isn't just about self-driving vehicles. CAV includes features that are currently included in vehicles sold today, such as lane assist or adaptive cruise control. The MedCity Mover in Rochester, Minnesota, is an example of a CAV that is literally on the road. People are transported by a highly automated vehicle that uses many different technologies like GPS, light-based radar, and cellular technology to operate on a pre-programmed route. The shuttles can detect vehicles, people walking or bicycling, and other objects on the roadway, and makes adjustments accordingly, like safely stopping. An operator is on board at all times to ensure safe operations and take control on occasion, but most of the time the shuttle operates on its own. It's one of the research and demonstration projects planned by the Minnesota Department of Transportation to ensure the technology works well for all people, in all conditions, including Minnesota's snowy winters. You can learn more about this revolutionary technology, demonstration projects in the state, and more by heading to our website, mindot.gov/automated.